military appreciation night here at City Field. Nearly 3,000 members of the military and their families given complimentary tickets into the ball game tonight. This is, of course, the Memorial Day weekend. It is Memorial Day in the United States and throughout all of Major League Baseball. Major League Baseball teams are wearing uniforms that have the camouflage names and numbers, the hats that the umpires are wearing, and then also the hats for the teams that are based in the United States. I just want to give a shout out to all our military personnel, both retired and current. Uh, thank you for your service to our great nation and giving us the freedom that we have and the ability to come and play baseball. And it's all made possible for your service, and uh, we're just so grateful to you. And uh, may God richly bless you and protect you and your families as well. Fans, it's time for today's ceremonial pitches. Cheer them on as all of our active duty, reservists, veterans, and military dependent guests throw a pitch to your Brewers and to the Minnesota Twins. Pitches. Thank you again to our entire military family. Challenger, the bald eagle, the regal eagle, flew in, made his appearance, took a lap around the park. Serving their country is one thing, going to war and living with that for the rest of your life, uh, something none of us can understand. And you just put your arms around them, you look up there uh, with the utmost respect. We certainly thank all of you who have served, are serving, and will serve. Defending the greatest country in the world, the United States of America. But today the highlight is the men and women of our military here gracing us with their presence. We salute them here on this very special Memorial Day in Washington, D.C. A lot of flags in the ballpark, a lot of red, white, and blue. It is Memorial Day where we honor the lives lost in defense of our country. Ceremonies all across the nation and throughout Major League Baseball. Fans here have acknowledged these veterans and their service to our country. There's the guy who threw out the first pitch, 90-year-old Pat Duncan, and the other veterans representing all five branches of the military here today. Half-price tickets were honored for veterans for this one and the Pearl Harbor survivors there, including Pat Duncan. Very special time in this country. Deep to right field. Kadir back in. Kadir in the corner. And this one will win it. Brandon Barnes comes up with a game winner in the 12th. What a great Memorial Day for Brandon Barnes. We love you, Mom. Up to Army, Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps. So who's today? Here? Hurrah! Hurrah! Ron White is a two-time USA memory champion. And since 10 a.m. this morning, he has been handwriting from memory the name of every fallen American soldier from the war in Afghanistan. It's really an amazing feat, a very touching tribute, especially because he is a veteran himself. We thank all of those, the veterans that have served in the past and those like those folks in these shots that serve our country today and keep us safe and do just incredible work around the clock, the bravery they show on this Memorial Day. We thank all of you and time to recognize everyone. Down the line, that's a fair ball! Here comes Miguel Montero and the Diamondbacks are walking off with a Memorial Day doubleheader sweep. And it's a day where you remember all that have sacrificed their lives to give us the freedoms that we enjoy and those that serve in the military today. We hope that you've enjoyed your Memorial Day and as a group, family and friends also had a safe and healthy and happy weekend.